International Women's Day is, I think, a really powerful moment to just step back and celebrate the achievement that women have made across the world, candidly, um, in our industry, um, at our company, uh, and, and to show the role models and the success stories of, you know, of women who are breaking their own barriers. Um, I also think it's a, an important moment just to, to educate around some of the bias and the discrimination that does take place. Um, in the workforce and, and across our industry every day. So I think it's, a, it's an important milestone to reflect, celebrate, and acknowledge. Diversity, equity, and inclusion to me is, is very personal, right? Is the, um, right now, the only female CEO um, of a betting company in the United States. Uh, there's a, a certain privilege and an obligation that I, I feel I have um, to advance gender diversity, not just within our own company, but to elevate the awareness and celebrate the achievements. This is something that is very personal to me. I've had the privilege of building diverse organizations to be in a position where I can, and our leadership team can single-handedly influence the kind of organization we build. And you know, if you look at the statistics, the, the data is incredibly compelling around it. If we get this right, gender diversity, diversity of all kinds, we are going to build a higher performing organization. We're going to have a more engaged employee base. We're going to solve problems better and the benefits are just are endless. In the last two years since I've been uh, with FanDuel and Flutter, um, I've seen a lot of change, right? I think the um, this starts with support from the top, right? And when you have the positive impact plan where we've gone out to not just our own employee base, but to the market, and made a commitment to, um, to support more women at the top of the organization, I think that's a huge shift. Uh, but we're also seeing it as, you know, it is an, becoming an ingrained part of the dialogue. And you're starting to see not just, you know, this is part of an ERG, but these are becoming mainstream programs that we're investing behind and we're talking about it at the top of the organization.